You would think that the government might have an idea where they're spending Canadian tax dollars, wouldn't you? I mean, if you're going to talk to the finance minister, don't you think maybe she would be able to come up with some answers? You know, this is one of the problems that we obviously have with the current uh, government. You know, our deputy prime minister, you know, chief of finance. Oh my God. You know, one of the things that is so annoying about her is that you can ask her a direct numeric question and she avoids it entirely. Let's take a look. Mr. Chair, uh, Minister, how much has the government collected in carbon taxes since you implemented it? Yeah, I didn't hear the last question. The how last part the of the question. has the government collected in carbon taxes since it, since it was implemented? Um, so thanks for the question. And it gives me an opportunity to be really clear about the price on pollution. This is revenue neutral. All the money hang, that is on. Collected was, hang on. Did she redirect the question? I mean, you know, what a gaslighter. She does this all the time. Let's see how many times she can avoid answering a question. And every single time, the ding a ling that she is, I'm going to hit my bell. A pretty specific all question. money that is uh, collected number, how goes much have... back directly to Canadians. I only have limited that time, is Minister. The key point. How much? How much has your government collected in carbon taxes? Also, an opportunity for me to point out that Manitoba families will be getting one thousand two hundred dollars this year. Again, Minister, if I could just have the number, how much have you collected in carbon taxes? The key point which Conservatives consistently are trying to keep from Canadians is that the price on pollution is completely Again, revenue neutral. Minister, the money does question. not go Canadians in the, the money is, does not go into what? general sorry, revenues. It is I'm returned sorry, to Canadians. What is the dollar value of all carbon taxes collected since the tax was implemented? The key point is that is money in the pockets of Canadians for Manitoba families this year. It's going to be twelve hundred dollars. That is making a real difference. Just the number, Minister. How much has the government actually collected in carbon taxes? As I said, the key point is it's all money that goes back to Canadians. It goes back to your constituents, okay. my constituents, with, Daniel's yeah. constituents. With the, with the greatest of respect, it's Mr. not Halland's revenue neutral. In fact, the it estimates. Is no, the minister. The estimates say that. You refuse to answer with giving accurate information, Minister. The government's own financial documents, your main estimate, show that you've collected $20.7 billion in carbon taxes and, and has only paid out $18.6 billion since the carbon tax took effect. Oh, your government has collected over $2 billion out of the pockets of Canadians since the tax was implemented that you have not paid back. That's from your own main estimate. So we that, correct the record. That, and Mr. Moraz, no, it is a hundred percent revenue neutral. And I'm are you glad saying the main I'm, estimates are wrong? I am saying that that is money that is being held for small businesses, and small businesses will have good news soon because that money is going to be returned to them. Wow. <laughs> You know what? I'm going to call her the dingling minister. I mean, she couldn't have avoided that question more. And yeah, hey, Marty, you know, I know you're putting her on the spot, but you would think she would know what's going on. So where did $2 billion of a Canadian taxpayer dollars go? Hey, you know what? Somebody's got to pay for those vacations that Trudeau just went on. $230,000 out of our pockets to send him on his last vacation. Hey, but wait a minute. He stayed with friends. So you know what? Thanks very much, Mr. Prime Minister. Let's just, you know, kick out a quarter of a mil for one of your vacays. And hey, listen, she's got to be whipping around the world out. After all, she was at the economic forum, you know, and how did she fly? Well, I'm pretty sure it was an economy. In fact, you know, she takes the Canadian private jets and of course, she's got to make sure she has her detail because she has to be protected from, oh, I don't know, everybody. So in the end, you know what? Here's the big picture. Two billion dollars not accounted for by the existing government. What else are they hiding? You know what? As I always say, you know what? We need to worry about Canadians. We need to worry about you and me. And more importantly, we've got to focus on what's going to happen in the future. Clearly, people like this are not. Make sure you subscribe. And I would love to hear your comments because you know what? It's so frustrating dealing with people like that. I like to see that we've got some like-minded people joining us.